What's up guys, welcome to another episode here at Trail Militia. So today, it's day three here at SEMA and um, I'm up here at this rooftop pool situation we got here at Spring Hill Inn. But I just wanna come up here and say thank you so much first and foremost. We just hit 1K, we're here at SEMA day three and now we're uh, pushing through man. I'm super tired, we were out all night last night having a good time celebrating 1K, celebrating the trucks being in SEMA. But today, we're gonna go dive in. I just came up here, it's on the top floor so I figured it'd be pretty cool to show you guys. There's the pool there, and then everything SEMA is right behind us. You can see the West Hall is here, and then Central Hall, South Hall is all the way back there. Our, our boy Oscar is here already. We're gonna go meet up with him. I'm gonna go grab a monster, and then, um, yeah, we're gonna dive back into the West Hall and see how the guys are doing, and then get it cracking. So stay tuned, we're gonna have a good time. Keep it locked. All right, team, so now we're in the West Hall once again. It's starting to look a lot more full in here. Yeah, so Warren's almost pretty much set up. They have a couple Broncos. There's still lifts in here doing their thing. Not sure who this is, Stinger Off-Road. But a lot of the other people are starting to set up here. I mean, SEMA get, kicks off tomorrow, man. SEMA kicks off tomorrow. So as expected, a lot of it will be done. See, there goes Warren. How long you guys get a right there in Meyer. Yeah, a lot more trucks in today. There's the Bronco. There's the Weston Booth. High lift is right here. So yeah, I'm gonna go check out, well, check in with Dave, see if he needs any help, and then we're gonna keep pushing. But so far, it's been fun, man. I've enjoyed it a lot, and uh, I'm curious to see what else came in the last couple of hours. Okay, so Alpha Rex is set up. This lethal threat looks pretty cool. It's all sealed up right now. Way more people are here now. The Mammoth is still here. It's still a little quiet though. Dude, look at that Dotson right there. That's wait till you go to the other hall. Dave's not feeling very well, guys. Good. He decided to party Tired. for 1K. Uh. <laughs> Dude, look at that color right there. Sweet. Oh, you should think they brought the Bronco factory. Oh, it's, it's over in there? there in the corner. That, oh, old, that old one? They know Chip Booth is. He's over there. He's working on the yeah. Chevy. Diodyne Dynamics is there. Fusion bumpers. Air design. BW's here. But I guess the other halls, the other halls are way busier. So we'll end up heading out over there and checking that out, South Hall, Tesla. Central Hall. Um, but we're gonna take the Tesla right finally. Dave said it's open today, so we're gonna go check that out. See if we can fight, find Bart from Anti-Gravity and then go do a couple uh, couple little things, uh, interviews and whatnot. Talk to a few people, pass out some cards, do some marketing things. Yeah, stick around, enjoy. Alrighty team, so we just pulled up to the Overland area. We're not quite done setting this up, but just wanted to show you what it looked like before we're done. The new tents on the rack and a different color obviously we got a couple scouts to set up obviously because halloween just passed by we're gonna set up a little campfire get the cooler put them around the table put some pamphlets out the gladiators looking good man we're gonna go ahead and knock this out and then i'll show you what it looks like around. mr oscar showed up what's up so he drives a burgundy four door sasquatch face model bronco damn i nailed that shit on the first that's try that's a mouthful but we're gonna go walk around check uh who else has set up and uh, see what's up dude look at these ones right here dog does your other bronco have a uh, hydro pumps off all right well, i showed you a sneak peek of the hummer but i didn't do a really good job of filming it so i'm gonna show you it now Woo! oh this is this one looks way nicer dude look at that screen bro My buddy, the one I went to go film with yesterday, uh -huh. they raced this in uh, Abu Dhabi. Yeah, they are taking it to the bottom. Are they? Yeah, that's what I heard. Ooh, this thing's sick, bro. Hello. Continentals, do these tires. Yeah. Damn. It's hot, boy. I like the colors. The colors are cool. But yeah, me and Oscar are gonna go ride that Tesla tram, see what's up. But yeah, they can't believe they're still setting up, man. They have like six hours to get this shit settled. And then it's a wrap. The show starts tomorrow, 9 a.m. to 6. Dude, Broncos everywhere, bro. But we already knew that was gonna happen, though. It's a Bronco Gladiator show. Bron yeah, exactly. Bronco Gladiator show. Ooh, this one's pretty sweet, too. The blue, bro. That blue is sick. Time matter, yeah. That's what we're gonna name. That's what we're gonna name this episode, bro. It's gonna be the Bronco show. This is the original color I ordered. What are those for? To protect the door and the plug, cover it all up. Oh, dude, that's dope. You don't get dirt in there, nothing. If you take off your doors, you'll see why these things make it. Oh yeah. I haven't taken them off yet. This is pretty cool. Molly pan on the rear. I like this thing to add more more shit in the top. This one right here. Sick. I could pass on these graphics, but 
the rest of it's cool. Dude, this is a little nice. See, this rep is dope. I want my rep to be like this. See? Yeah, this is sick. You see how like they put Sasquatch? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put like mythical creatures and shit all hidden. Dude, that's sick. That's dope. They did a good job on this rep. If I don't sell that Bronco, I'm gonna redo it all. Dang, Rad Flow. No wonder you made me wait, bros. Woo! This thing is mean, bro. Damn. That's a that's a good one. That's, I like the green of 20 locks. Yeah. Woo! One of these shocks is for the Bronco. I don't know which one it is, but. Oh, it tells you right here. This is for a Colorado. The Colorado shock ZR2 guys are here. Boom. Like 2.5s? Probably. 2.5s? They gotta be like these or something. They don't have a tag on this one? No. I think they just forgot that one. Dude, it might be this one. That's a good one right there. Woo! Damn, Radflow's boot is pretty sick. Their uh, rig here is. I got my Dang, we found the Radflow. Cool over. Look at that. Damn. Sick, bro. Can't wait to put those on. Oscar's gonna break down all the Broncos. He's gonna tell you how he really feels about them, and they're bullshit, and they're good shit. Let's go, dog. ARB one first. Let's go. Well, first of all, it's a four door. First. <laughs> Press Bronco around. <laughs> First of all, it's a station wagon. <laughs> no, it's not a station wagon. It's a rarest of them all. Four door Bronco. Tell me about this big ass bumper, dog. It's a big bumper. It has, you know, it's a bumper, bro. That's my name. <laughs> That's the best I can say about it, to be honest. I mean, it looks very like what? Like the safari style? It looks a lot of safari, a lot of, you know, European style. But bumper they did kill style. it with the mount up here. Yeah, the air compressor is mounted really nice. I don't think there's anything else in the market yet that fits that nice. You know. so, Are these the factory ones, though? Factory roof rails. Nice. This red is pretty nice, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, this is uh, RTR wheels. 35s? It's not. Yeah, 35s. They have the zero bridge on here. Look at this uh, this little thing, this pull out. This jack mount's pretty interesting. This jack mount is dope. This is cool. It's all air, I think, too, right? Yep. Give me your thoughts on this bumper, though. It's probably one of the better ones, to be honest. It's Why? Because it's just simple? It's simple, but then again, they kept it wide. So yeah. a, lot of, a lot of people are not going to like that. Yeah, that's true. But it's either this or your fender, bro. But it's this is a good bumper for this model. Okay. Because of the painted fenders and all that wing. stuff. <laughs> I meant the Bronco Edition. <laughs> Woo. All right. So that's a quick breakdown of the ARB. We're going to keep moving. We'll give you a little slight breakdown of each one. Bronco Factory's next. You guys seen that one at, uh, what was it? Four Wheel Parts? The Offroad Expo. Offroad Expo out in Ontario. He's here now. We're going to go check it out. That's true. All right, Oscar. Bronco Factory, dog. Hit me with it. All right, he's already scoping out the details, but they have a sick ass wrap on it. I really like the wrap. I like the wheels. The wheel combo color combo is really dope. This thing's as messed up as mine at the bottom already. And nice. So, so you're approved? <laughs> yeah, you're approved. So they jumped you at theirs too. Not as high as me, but they jumped it. But now it's a built. They got Kings. They got Bronco Factory arms. Dude, I want those. I see that right there. Those arms are sick. It's, it's shut down. I mean, I'm pretty sure that they didn't do much to the inside just because yeah, it's got the they, ADD, they actually boogie. Fire. Yeah, and they do have car fire fenders, so those are sick. And you said they're selling it, right? Yeah, about 110,000, something like that. Yeah, 110,000 gets you that. I was like, oh shit, they made a bumper. No, That's just a sticker. It is yeah. proven though, but it is sweet. So we're going to move on to the next one. It's a red spicy one over there with the big fenders that look ugly from here, but we're going to go find out. This one actually has a lift. They actually dropped down the third member. The first oh, one I yeah. see that did that, not just a spacer lift. That's true. No, but it's on factory shots. Yeah, that's a spacer right there. Yeah, have a spacer up top, but then yeah, dude, that's no, that's gross, bro. But look at that, look at that, look at the axle angle. That does, that you does can't not, beat the yeah, angle. but that's not gonna drive nice. But with a good set of coilovers, this thing will ride better than anything else out here. You're right, you're right. That's the only but thing. But not, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Still needs it for A arms too. Yeah, but we're, we're gonna agree that these are better than the ones for four wheel parts. That's true. This, this is, is the first one I see with the Ford. Covers. This is the black diamond also, so this yeah. one's not not, not as spicy. These are actually the first ones I see from Ford. The protectors. That's a nice flex. The, the arms in the rear. It's yeah, they have arms. Oh yeah, the lowers. Yeah, lowers. Not the uppers. That's dope though. They're stock. adjustable. There's actually stock, non-sasquatch, nothing too. So yeah, you're probably right. It rides like shit. Yeah, this this rides like boogie for sure. The color's cool though. It's a good mall crawler for what it is. To be it's honest, on, it's on forty. It's a mall crawler though. Yeah, it is. It is they it did is everything to lift it, but nothing for performance. That's right. It's just tall. So that can't keep up with your station. Nope. Dude, it's gonna be all day, bro. It's gonna be a punishment all day, bro. 
You're only hitting because you can't take your trick to San Hollow. And I can if I want to. Oh, uh, that hurts my feelings. See why they have to go that low, bro? <laughs> Damn. All right, next one up is another two door. This one's red, man. I'm, I'm interested in what you're gonna say about this one, dude. Hit me with it. Do we even have to make a video on this thing? Damn. Oh, this is the first big bend I've seen, too. Yo, did they go from having. They dropped a bit. But look at these arms are weaker than the stock ones. Yeah, and using the stock bob joint, too. They just hit like a weird arm. Ew, these fenders are gross. <laughs> but it's a big bend sand squash? What? Havoc. That's, that's a thing? These are four tube doors offered in Canada, not to us yet. Oh, yeah? Can we own both of them? Four factory, both on them. Yeah. They had them at first and then they took them off our market. Dude, wow. this interior yeah, is booty, bro. You gotta get seats for this, bro. These general yeah, grabbers are nice, though. Serious. On race we're lines? We're doing a lot of white lines. They're not bad. Um, yeah, that is we're nice. get close I'm not feeling that rack either. See, another rear bumper. Oh, this, one. I, this one's okay. See how they kept it tight? Oh, you yeah, get rid of, did, you get rid of these, the whatever these are. These look, that'll look a lot nicer. <laughs> what are these, bro? F-150 ones? <laughs> <laughs> the F-150 fenders, dog. The color match top is nice. Though, the color match top is dope. But I didn't think I was gonna exact, like it. It's not exactly match. They could have done a better job than painter, but if you look, this one's a little more orange on the bottom. Yeah, what's up with all these marks too? Come on, man. They need somebody to detail it. Oh, it's blends in the paint. Oh, really? Oh, that sucks. Yeah, it doesn't look bad except for the fenders. I don't no, get, I understand. This is, not, this is not a good truck. It's not a good truck though. Yeah, suspension's kind of. It's a two-door, you know, no sirvo. Yeah. All right. So there you go. Oh, there Oscar. you go, bro. <laughs> Oh, oh, there it oh, is, there bro. It is. That's a, the one that they were asking me for, too. The two and the four door had a baby. Damn. Limo rides galore, bro. This thing went to Truck Hero. Yeah. Shit. Damn. I think Irv, one of my boys, asked me to record this. There you go, Irv. There's a six seater, bro. And it's an Eco Diesel? Oh, Damn. shit. So, yeah, I think this color only came in Eco Diesel. So that way, when you hit the trail, it just splits in the middle? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dude, and they did the extra speakers in the back. Oh shit. Look at that. Sick. <laughs> Give me a breakdown, bro. I'm trying to figure out how they cut it. Where they cut it? They probably covered it with this, no? No. Oh, it's right, right here, here, bro. Oh, I'm looking at the frame. Yeah. Woo! Terraflex. Falcon shocks. The splits right here where you can talk. Yeah. Section the front door. They did a good job though. Yeah, not bad. Frames off made and everything. Did, uh, it's on Terraflex axles. It's actually pretty well built. More, yeah. Well stretched on trucks. They're, they're hack jobs. Not this Damn. one. Damn. That's dope. Alright, Irv, so, you got what you wanted, dog. There's your six bike. Woo! Really nice right here. Woo! Oh, never mind. You see the frame? Bro, but then the wheels? Uh -oh. Can it do something better? Let's have a Cummins. Is it on red flows? It is a Cummins though. And then, <laughs> hey, 9,000 pound winch, bro. Come is on, bro. Winch, Come on. Super winch. Please get at this, man. Sponsor this truck, please. Yeah, man. He needs the 18,000. Yeah, 18, there's a truck hero badge. Yeah, come on, man. This K50 is dope, but come on. That's like a Civic winch. Truck, truck, wall crawler right here. Dude. All right, I was really impressed from afar, but it's like one of those, <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those situations when as soon as you get close, Nope. Nope. Oh shit, another Bronco. This one actually looks kind of nice, bro. It's probably the most popular Bronco that first came out. Oh yeah? yeah. Oh, it's a four-wheel four Bronco, yeah. That's right. I never even saw this, but it was always parked right next to the Gladiator. So this one's better more of it's performed fairly well. Yeah? Yeah. The only problem I have with this rack, you can't use the soft top at all. I actually asked the engineer about this at the four part show. Oh, that's right. And he was confused. Because I told me the top opens like this. He was like, oh. We'll figure it out. So you're smarter than the engineer, is that what you said? Sounds like it, bro. Yeah. <laughs> and just clarifying it, he is smarter than me. You engineer. cannot open this top at all, so it makes this top useless. Dude, Forget that's about the, the one that I want, bro. That bar right there? That is very nice. That is very nice. Rigid? Rigid? <laughs> I'll be seeing you soon. Yeah, this is sweet. I don't like the bumper too much. It sticks out a little bit too much for my liking. But yeah. like you said, this one actually has put in work. It's actually worked, yeah. It's one of the first ones that actually did a lot of work. What other shocks does it have? Their own four-wheel parts. Oh, uh, yeah? DSI makes them. Oh, okay somewhere in california the rear bumper is actually one of the first that matches the, the, the curvature, curvature. Yeah. yeah so it's actually it's not a bad bumper it has a sensor the tow package all right I whoever see. designed those four parts actually thought it out well very well yeah good job for being the leader market too yeah they were actually they were one of the first ones to do this so and they actually did the relocation bracket for the 37 so oh yeah non sasquatch guys could put big tires and spare tire Damn. See, knowledge, bro. Dude, knowledge, bro. I got too much time. These lights are nice, too. Look at this, too. 
They have their own accessory rail. Nobody's had Dude, that yet. Dude, I'm ready for that, no bro. One has it. I this want that so bad. Yeah, I'm ready for an accessory. Hopefully, we find one here. Somebody oh, will have one here. Have it. Black I've diamond. seen a couple, but nobody has them for sale. All right, so that's the breakdown of the four-wheel parts. Bronco, a lot of you guys have seen that, though, because it is one of the more popular Broncos that's been in pretty much everywhere. But yeah, sweet, well-built. Not really much we can say about it, man. It boogies. It's got arms, got coils. It's got lower links, um, upper links. I'm not a fan of those steps, but, I mean, yeah. can't be perfect, bro. Nope. I'll hit my beats. Just pinch welds? Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're going to keep it moving. Let's go find this Tesla tramp. F 150. This is a four door. Ah, dude, these are from like a F 250 or something, <laughs> but these are massive. They're not the same ones, they're bigger. Damn. Dude, this bumper too. Uh, dude, this sticks out so much. You got a little better approach angle. Look at this right Yeah, how'd you get? How'd you this get? truck went from having like a 20 inch drop off to having like a. Fucking, how'd you get worse, bro? They got worse, man. <laughs> it's a downgrade. Dang. Dude, this is a wild track too. And it's so heavy, it's actually dragging the front down. Oh, it is? It. Yeah. It has a leveling kit on it. Yeah, it's still shorter from the boat. It's still Wildtrak interior though. He's got the big screen. Dude, the Wildtrak, why is it brown, bro? What's that? Leather, that plastic, tan? whatever. That tan color is gross. It's an NDV something interior though. I'm disappointed with this one, bro. But they just got this Wildtrak soft top. Dude, come dude these are power wagon fenders, bro. Jesse, you let this guy borrow your fenders, bro? <laughs> you know what you did? They're not power wagon fenders, they're just ugly. That's it. That's the title. <laughs> We're out here hating big, yo. So drop down in the comments. Oh, uh, this truck is a, <laughs> this is a super dongle. They even blocked all the sensors on this thing. Oh, Every they sensor did. Is no, they has got some in there. No, no the Oh, sensors, the bottom ones, your huh? Your crash sensors, your camera's pointing right at the fucking wind. <laughs> good job, I mean, guys. That's a good, you know. Good job, guys. Good, so instead of having a 360, you have a 270 view. Yeah. <laughs> 120, bro. That's it. You got back and sides. That's it. Dude. They downgraded this thing, bro. Yeah, don't buy a pump and let this guy see it because he's going to get you, dog. <laughs> Leave it stock. Leave it alone. Yeah. Woo. All right. So I know in the comments you guys are going to get crazy. Um, I'm going to put his IG right here. Go ahead. Drop some bombs on him. But on, it's all in the name of love, but it's facts. honestly, we're just pulling up some facts because see everybody knows SEMA can get a little wild when it comes to trucks But there is some well-built trucks here, too So don't think it's all bullshit like there's some nice ones and we're gonna point it out We're gonna say when they did it right um, But they just have it <laughs> the video will be a lot shorter, bro. Yeah, it's a good thing There's a lot of bad ones and only a couple good ones. The next one is the best one. Hey, dude, there you go no, 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 let's go look. You got one Bronco. You got oh, fucking, we gotta go see you the, gotta do the best build, build yet. The best build yet. Yep. Damn. I'm excited, bro. All right, fam. Stick around. We're going to go see this uh, very popular, very famous by my man Oscar Bronco. Got you. Here, here we go, bro. No, it's not. Here we go. Here we I go. Ready? Go. Ready, dog? Damn, with the reveal, dude. <laughs> it's, got, right. it's got rigids. Oh, That's, does it? It's got rigids. Come on, rigid. Put this bumper, dog. <laughs> I don't know what they... They got it from Picky Party. <laughs> And then you got Damn. We got 24s, American 4s on. Dude, dude, look at these arms, upper arms. Look at them arms, arms though. <laughs> and they they part of the lower stocks. Yeah. Check that out. Hey, we're allowed to talk shit because we own Broncos, bro. Yeah, we So do. you know how they can't go in the comments and be like, hey, you guys talk shit, you can't even own a Bronco? Hey, we own them. We own Broncos. And okay? use them. And we use them. So we're allowed to. Oh, what's that? What they put a 13 inch space? Dude, they machine us a rim just for this. The what? They like machine this room just to fit this thing. Yeah. Wow. I don't even know. They got, oh, they got the rough country. Hey. They did something right. Check this out. For the heaviest tire, they put the rough country reinforcement oh, yeah? plate. And they didn't fuck with the fenders. That's true. They that that wild track ruined the fenders. They should have put them at 350 fenders like the rest of them. <laughs> they would have topped it off, dude. Powder coated the rear axle. Upgraded nothing, but they powder coated it or painted it. One or the other. They had an exhaust? Nah, dog. This is our rattle can. Look at the dust shields. It has overspray. Oh, no. That's a Magnafro Street, Street Outlaw exhaust. Have you heard it? It sounds like Honda. Does it? No. The one thing that this truck should have had, it's a 12 inch screen and it doesn't. Where's all those subs? Where's the subs at? They're there. Oh, those are subs right there? Yeah. It's got two. Oh, yeah? Two 12s. Probably sounds good, bro. King. It probably, probably does. But <laughs> probably. <laughs> I doubt it because they put these, <laughs> they put these big old cells, but they let the stock. This is a base model. If you see, if you've heard the speakers on the base model, 
It sounds like your grandma's, you know, that big top speaker they used to hey, have. Hey, bro, I don't like the ones on the Badlands either, bro. So These sound horrible. They're like paper. Uh, They're the cheapest of the cheap. But it's got subs. Dude, so. it's got arms, though? No, he doesn't. <laughs> They're just colored. Dude, all right. So that was the one that Oscar was really um, excited about. He said this is the one that should win. Even took out the skid plate, you can see the oil. But they didn't block the intercooler. That's true. They didn't block they, the intercooler. They, they did a better job see, than Warren. They, they did they a better, better job, job than Warren. Yikes. Dang. Is the solo motorsport more favorable Broncos here? One of them at least. Oh, it's okay. It's got the clean 2.5s with adjustable, you know, fully adjustable. And that's what you're thinking of getting, right? Yes, sir. The solo upper A arms, double shear. So I'm gonna touch it. Probably shouldn't. They welded these guzzets back here. Okay. To so all the weight's not in the front, so, so it's, it's, a, a, it's a double shear. Yeah, you can see it on that side a lot better. Nice. You know, the modular bumper, kind of wrong with Yeah. I actually really like the stock factory. A lot of bumper. people are taking off these bumpers and putting God knows what. It's actually, <laughs> that looks nice. It just works. Really nice touch. It's an outer bank, so this is a 2.4 probably. Just so. gonna use some side steps. You know, the steps are a little. Yeah. They'll be going off. But Scott King Ooh, C's. The Kings look nice, bro. KMC's on KO2 is probably one of the best combos out there. I hate KO2s, bro. Why? Because I hate the ones that I had. You don't know how to drive your truck. Oh, ho, ho. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, Whoa, buddy. I allow a lot of things, I but not there. that. Yeah, I allow a lot of things, but not that, right? <laughs> that hurts my feelings. <laughs> nah, but yeah, I mean, simple, right? Simple, simple, enough. simple effective. Uh, this is like a foster child for the Bronco should be. Yeah. Minor upgrades. You don't need everything. Shocks, A-arms, that's it. I need the Shout out to King, you did a good job. Tesla tunnel. So basically what you do is you pull up, get in line, and you tell the driver what hall you want to go to so it's either central or south we're here at the west hall now so we're going to transport ourselves all the way down to south and see how that feels and it's underground so who knows man this is some futuristic shenanigans right here we're going to go break down one more bronco before we hit this tunnel let's get it break this one down first of all evil truck follow him check him out on youtube if you have to make sure you bring a tow truck because if he gets a flat no spare tire no spare tire also this is the first problem no, not even inside. Have an air horn. Also, everybody needs an air horn. First right? one with an air horn. Yeah, first one with an air horn. You break down, you have no tire, you can blow your horn. Somebody will stop. He's got B-lock rings. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's got rock, rock guards right here. But probably, it'll probably work, to be honest. Honestly, these look... These actually look not bad. <laughs> I wonder why they have points for a high lift. Um, I can't tell. Which one's the one with the blue trim? Is that the Outer Banks, right? No, like, yeah. Outer Banks are... Big Ben, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's either an Outer Banks or Big Ben. It's probably a Big Ben because it doesn't have um, Haas as a stock. Yeah, and it's, it's not a Sasquatch truck either. So. I do like those little rigid pods though. Yeah, like those are cool. cool. Oh snap, it's got BDS upper arms. BDS upper arms, yeah. See, it looks way cleaner when you cap that. It does look way cleaner. This I, bumper though. I gotta look into that. Talk to me about this bumper, dog. It's weird, Bodyguard. bro. The intercooler is getting no air. So it's blocking yeah. all the performance part of it. Just make sure you're not going fast. Don't get the yeah. troubles hot. Pretty much don't drive it like a Bronco. Yeah. Drive it like a Jeep. Oh shit, dude. I'm sorry, I had to say it. And there goes my channel. Nah, but yeah, so the paint's no. good. I mean, that's the stock factory paint, right? Yeah. No? No, is it? It's not, right? It's not a cyber orange, is it? It might be. I don't know. Comment below. Do you guys think this is the original paint? Yeah, it is. It's cyber orange. Is it? Bodyguard bumpers stick out too much. Wheels or whatever. Stock suspension. If you're into if that you're kind into of stuff. stuff. Oh, that's enough of that. Let's go get in this uh, Tesla underground tunnel situation the teslas pull up you tell them what hall you want to go to and bada bing bada boom you're at the next spot so we'll record it as we're underground and check this stuff out dude elon musk is out here killing it bro i am making our life better we got 40 today and 60 tomorrow or 30 and 60 no something like that cars yeah 70 tomorrow. 70 tomorrow 70. there you go got the the black uber x let's get it Ooh, push here to open check this out Let's go. Yes, sir. Yeah, quick. Right. And nearest to strip club, please. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, there you go. Damn, I'm underground. All right. We're like El Chapo right now. Dude, this is, this is where you guys hit El Chapo, huh? This is El Chapo got a way through. <laughs> We're going straight to Mexico, school, dude. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice, yeah, man. Okay. Can it be the Bronco down here? A little sideways action. Hot wheels? <laughs> yeah. Just go around circles though. It does look like it's a Hot Wheel little yeah. track on. Damn. Okay, Elon Musk, I see you. Dude, we gotta build one of these under the 91 freeway. For real. 
And the five. Thursday, <laughs> Friday, trying to go to the desert? Damn. Damn. Good luck. One that goes straight to Johnson Valley from my house, bro. There we go. One way. Dude. It's pretty sweet. It's pretty it's sweet pretty to see sweet. one. So this is only open during like shows? Is that what it is? Yeah. Okay. Conventions, yep. All right. types, yep. How many hours do you do this a day? 10, 12. Oh, oh shit. Damn. Okay. Do you know Elon? <laughs> At this point, I wish. No. You probably driven more miles than anybody else. Right. In a Tesla. So do you guys got like swap cars to charge it or? Uh, huh? Do you, you got to stop this car eventually and charge it? No, we have other cars charging right now. Oh, okay. If I ever need one to so go just grab swap. it. But no, I never need one. Nice. Oh. So do you recommend the Tesla? That's the cheapest one. 38 grand. Okay. Damn, they're that cheap? I didn't really? hear that. I thought it was a lot more money than that. I thought they were way more this than that. This is the low end test out right here, you know? Oh, so you said not this one, but a Tesla? There's, <laughs> there's, a, there's, a, there's a fast one, right? Yeah, there's yeah. the X, yep. The double yeah. mortar, triple there's the something. S, yep. Well, that was sweet, man. What was your name? Pete. Pete. Thanks, Pete, Pete for the ride. Pete All right. The roof, so, yeah, if you guys are at right. SEMA, I know, look at that. Dude. You guys are at SEMA? Come, come check out the Tesla Underground Tunnel. Let's go. We just got dropped off at the South Hall. You guys saw that Tesla tunnel thing. That's pretty sweet, man. It's just really thoughtful. It's definitely some ingenuity for sure. Um, you're not up top messing with traffic or anything like that. So we're going back to South Hall, catch more Bronco footage for you guys and uh, spit some game. You know how it is? Let's get it. Let's go. 1552 wheels, those are nice. That's what our Bronco has. There you go. The worn rear bumpers actually looks clean. It's not that bad on this one. It looks clean. Yeah, it's actually nice. The one Elite. Look at the fenders, bro. AVD carbon fiber. Uh, carbon fiber. Those are nice, and it's the. Uh, and it's a Sasquatch model. Yeah. Fender, right? Yeah, nice. Pinstripe is nice. Pinstripe is nice. It's different. You know, they put the Bronco, the Switch logo down here, the cursive is kind of up here. Yeah. Like everybody else, including myself. He's got a best top, just like me. Super tires. And I do like the STT Pros, that's what the XJ had. Yeah, not bad. They're really nice. Not to be a dick, but they're trying to do a photo shoot right now. Oh, shit. I'll get out of the so way. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Color match grill. Yeah, the nice girl, the blue's nice. I hate that hobo, bro. Yeah, the ABD. I hate that. Yeah, I hate On it. another one. With the power wagon fenders. Outer banks. Hey, the rims are not bad, though. Yeah, they're kind of so tall. It's kind of has space for something. The two real tires, though? Oh, yeah, it's got like a three space from top. On top of the non oh, regular. Yeah. regular. Regular suspension, not, nice not the Haas. The tent's pretty cool. It's medium. It doesn't have that scoop thing. Oh, I do like that. I do like that. That is really, really nice. Just pass on. Are we just gonna skip it? Or are we gonna skip the front bumper? Because there's not, it's enough set. Yeah. Spacerless? Dude, they got spacers stacked on spacers. Damn. Hey, but it made it here, bro. I'm not driving, I bet you. Yeah, man, this, know, is, like, this is just to pull up and that's it. That's it. It does have the factory Bronco flips. Yeah. yeah. This interior is nice, though. It is. For the outer banks, the colors are cool. Like blue gray. Blue gray. Two door outer banks. Tents okay. Wheel choice, debatable. Tires debatable. I've never seen these tires off. Bro. Tires not even debatable. Have you seen the these tires? Tours, yeah. I have never seen them. They're like the Patagonia. Oh, I hate Patagonia, bro. Say yeah. less. Say less, bro. Say less. All right, there goes another Bronco. Oh, we got another one right here. I like the. I like what they do with the hood. He's looking. It's a lot better. It's a wall track, yeah. Wall track, four parts. Uh, There's a four part. Yeah, four, four wheels, yeah, four parts. Yeah, built. four part shocks. No, this is not four. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, bro. My size, see one. Damn, you do, you do know it, bro. You do know it. Yeah, it's pretty dope. I'm not saying I approve of it, but it's crazy. This goes hard. This goes hard in the paint. Dude, you got what is this? What kind of truck is this? A Cummins, probably, right? Yeah. Now, why does it has a... It's, it's probably Hayabusa then. That's what they put in those smart cars. Yeah, right? Yeah. It probably is a Busa, right? Yeah. You got to give them an A for effort, though. Bro, this has got a Fox 2.0. That's it's sick, man. This sick. <laughs> this is built better than my Bronco, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I want to drive it. <laughs> Dude, you're just going to go like this. I don't care. I want to yeah. drive it. You slam the brakes, you go forward. Dang, he's got the little car, the big the truck, boat. and the boat, bro. Okay. Hey, look. I already have one of those at the house. It's small. <laughs> I just need a big truck now. <laughs> I just got it. I just need... We're gonna turn the Fiat bro, into that. The Fiat, there we go. Dude, we're gonna turn the Fiat into that. I'm gonna turn Jesse's truck into that. And then I just gotta figure out a boat. And that's it. <laughs> Dude, I'm almost there. Yeah, I'm close, bro. I'm close, bro. Is the McLaren with them too? But... Ooh, no, the McLaren's not with them. 
It's all money though. That is money. Oh yeah, it's over there, the bumpers. We gotta go look at that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, but no. Tell me you got money without telling me you got money. I'm pretty sure that's the owner too. You got that? Yeah. I don't know who he is, but he has a McLaren. Let's go. What are we gonna talk about? This is this is a big deal right here. This is a big deal. It's probably one of the most popular Broncos in the past week. So Not it's either here. really loved or really hated because they yeah. completely turned it into a Jeep, basically. Let's just yeah. be real. But let's go look at it. Let's go look at it. And it's in the section that I disagree. Yeah, it should like, not be here. It should not be in this section with these. Like, come on, man. Like, that should, no, it shouldn't oh. be here. But we're going to check my man here. He fabs, so he's going to start checking shit. I do like the wrap. The wrap is sick. Yeah, bro. this is like a 1978 yeah, to 82 like... freewheel special Bronco. Ooh. They were some of the most popular. These at night, you put a flash tone. They're actually like chrome, oh, yeah? chromatic. You take a picture at night, all you can see is the graphics. And so I believe these are as well. Yeah, they are. Dude, it looks well built so far. The links look good. They look proper. Talk to me, dog. Don't be don't be so quiet. Well, um, you know, it's solid axle. Captain Obvious over here. <laughs> I mean, that's like the best thing I can say so now. What kind of shocks does it have, though? Kings? I'm sure it's Kings, right? They're Kings or or uh, Rat Flows? Fox. Oh, they're Foxes? Fox, yeah. Oh, yeah, they are Foxes. I don't know, dude. The color's sick. This custom grill is dope. It's a homage to all the throwback, right? Yeah, so this, he, he, they did like their own heritage grill, like the 66, not 66, 67 or 74, 77. Dude, Broncos. that is dope. Well, sort of, because it doesn't have that curvature like the top should have. And See then you, you can't put the top on either. Oh my God. Oh yeah, you can't. I do like the pods though, rigid. Those are sick too. This grill is sick, but it don't say Bronco, it says Ford, like I believe, I think it should have been. Dude, his steering wheel sick, that car and steering wheel. I saw that, that it's thing's like red. cut off. Yeah, that thing is fresh. Oh, look at the seats, too. I know no the bags. seats. He took the tops off? Yeah. Every did them. This is Mickey Thompson in the rear. Well, they, the actually, they, should, they actually built something? Yeah, they did. That's pretty dope. Yeah, they built some type of frame. That's pretty cool. They covered all the holes, you know. They... Yeah. It's not bad. Their bumper's not bad. I would have liked it not to have this if they Ooh, were going to get rid of it. Look at that rear axle. Oh, oh, my God. That's where it's at right there. All right. All right. Nice truck, but. But. There's a butt on this swallow. These? For sure, right? The steps, yeah. But my oh. problem with this is the actual swallow axle swap. This track bar bracket has literally got like $5 tabs on it. That's true. I can see that. I can see those tearing off. It's not as, it's not as stressed as much because it's got full hydro. Yeah. But it's still just literally two four dollar tabs from from rough stuff these towers as well um so much money and such a new truck i would have done something more bolt-on welding's the easy way out yeah on the build something old i get it something just put this much money in it i wouldn't have done that and if we look at the lower a arm the radius arm bracket this bracket is four dollars or fourteen dollars sorry from rough stuff and it's just bottom welded it should have been you know some side plating bolted um, this is what you would do in your backyard. It should not be on this truck at all. Damn. That is my problem with this truck. All right. That being said, if it was like a cheap $100, $100 truck. Damn, dude. T get your numbers right, bro. This I'm, 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 I'm out of words this video, this thing. This video is going to have the most negatives in fucking ever, bro. It probably will, bro. But hey, everybody loves this you know, thing. You know what, Delphab? <laughs> no, it's a nice truck. Don't get me wrong. It's a very nice truck. It's a... A lot nicer than most people would do, but it's still they still were the first. Let's get they were that. the first. They were the first. But I am curious to see it wheel, like really go wheel, uh, and see if it falls apart or not. And I should love this thing because I love solid axle. I, you know, most of my trucks are solid axle swapped and stuff. So I was excited to see it. I want a solid axle in my Bronco. I wish you would have kept Dana's though. Dude, the thing's bad though. Hydro this stops. Thing, oh, this thing's bad. Look at it wrong. Shocks are dope. No, it's, it's a bad truck. It's just, Some minor tweaks. I would have done this swap a little Some bit. Some minor tweaks for strength, right? Yeah. The logo set. Yeah, like you probably see the track bars over here. Woo. Check this out. I'll also give you the breakdown on the Delphab. Whether that you grill, like it. Look at that grill. That grill is sick. The heritage grill. Same. You like it or hate it, they did it first. All right, we're going to keep it moving. The rest of the gang is pulling up tonight. We'll probably go get some drinks, hang out somewhere. And uh, I got to get to editing to drop this video too. And uh, go watch the video one and video two. They're all online now. We made 1K. Thanks again. Center lines, B locks, those are nice. Wheel choice is good. I see kings. Before I turn the camera around, we see, see kings, choices. we see B locks, we see Toyo MTs. Interesting wrap. Interesting wrap for sure. This is KC Life Bar. That's it's very, uh, that, yeah, bro, to me. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right, ready? This one's actually pretty nice. It's like, yeah, it's potential here.
Dang. It's got that drop down step, but also real right. sliders. Close to, yeah, yeah. I, I, I want to see him get tested. That's true, that's true. And it is a first edition. There's a, there's a hundred grand plus right here. Woo, and it matches the color scheme. Yeah, this one looks good with this wrap. Yeah, the interior looks really good with this wrap. Dude, that those lights, bro. Those lights are just clean. KC, just hit me my, up. Just got my setup right here, bro. Keys uh, with the camera. Look at up KC there. in the front right here too. Shit, everywhere. Look at the ones on the, yeah. the ditch lights. Too. Those ditch lights are sick yeah. too. So the Camberg of the King setup. That's probably what. That's, that's the setup what you're I want. With? That's what I want. Eventually. Camberg King, sorry. Camberg. Dude, it's got. Oh, they do. They put their UBL sound system on it. Oh, this is nice right here. This is nice. Oh, a bracket. There you this go. This bracket's different. It looks They've actually strong, got, bro. It has mounting positions. Oh yeah, to put more stuff on it. Yeah. He's sure. got a Pro Eagle jack back there. A seal tank. Yeah, this is, pack, this is this is the one. This could be the nicest one here. Because they didn't overdo it with the bumpers. This is, yeah, you're right. It probably still. It's got the whole KBL sound, sound bar. Yeah, I agree. I think this might this be the is, nicest. Yeah, it might be the nice one, yeah. They did good on the wrap. It's very different, but it's really nice. Yeah. Very tattoo -y. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. This is a California build. Awesome. You know what would be cool, though? That they would have done black here. This is definitely California. Black. Like swap the color? Yeah. Black yeah. and then the blue little symbols? That would have been Still sick. The card. Especially because you know it's black. So you think it's a California truck? Yeah. yeah. I mean, that's just because of the bear. The bear and Kings, just bro. The build in general looks yeah. California. Dude, look at these lights are perfect, bro. That top them. Man. That's like $7,000 right there. All right, so the owner of this truck? California. Very nice. Very nice. You guys California. did it well. You guys did it really well. Thanks, Fire. Yeah, I think this is, what, this is the nicest Bronco so it, far. Yeah. yeah. First edition Sasquatch. Yeah. That's all of it, huh? All the bells and whistles. Oh, everything. Ooh, that thing's fire. Yeah. That's a nice one. Is this one so tall? There's been a lot to it. That's right. Sure. I do like the rims. They're black rhinos. What's the suspension? What's the suspension? suspension. What is it? Valtec. I've seen the decolor. I'm assuming, yeah. Because they got callovers that are well maxed out. Spindle kit, diff drop. Oh, they did. Yeah, it's about tech. You see the chrome in there? Yeah. It's about tech. I don't, I don't like that drop, dude. The skip plate's nice. It's okay. Skip, skip plate's nice, yeah. It's tall. That bodyguard winch uh, bumper again. That fucking bumper, bro. I'm still conflicted by that, bro. It is a bad lens. Here's the first one I see that has a. Uh... Here's the first one I see that has this, too. Mine has it. Does it? Oh, yeah, yours does have it. This one has upgraded uh, spindle. The first one I see with that. Yeah, they dropped the axle on the rear, too. Yeah. Yeah. Track bar. Not a fan of it, dog. No, not either. It's too tall. They would never boogie with me. Walking around, breaking down these Broncos. We're pulling up to what we want to say is where the real Broncos are at. Yeah, because haver. we got the fun haver tent, and uh, this is kind of what I want my Bronco to look like, man. I'm not even lying. Yeah. At some point. <laughs> at some point. Yeah. This is. This is the absolute dream right here, bro. Uh, I'm gonna look at what's actually, you know, it's not possible. <laughs> hey, bro, don't be shutting down my dreams, bro. Yeah. This one has a lot of prototype stuff, a lot of fun haver stuff. Yeah. Well, the center lines are good. First one with Fox. Hey, look at these sliders. Oh, yeah. Dude, the sliders are nice. Do you recognize them? Yeah. Where from? From yours? Basically. Did you copycat these, bro? No. Brain mounted too. But they welded them. They're nice, though. Yeah, no, these are clean. Same? They added an angle to it, which is a lot Those nicer. Those rims are nice, bro. They are, bro. They look good. Look at that brain arm right there. Ooh, and they're actually driven on it? This is actually high school. Oh, damn. That's the one for Blockbuster. That's happening. It's a Mustang Maquis. Damn. Damn. Mustang Maquis. This bumper's dope too. This is the one that made me want to put 37s on my See, but look at you. ready to do that? I will. Yeah? Bro, never let aesthetics affect your performance. Performance. Oh, oh yeah? Right. <laughs> am I wrong? Yeah, I mean, you're right. I mean, am I wrong? You're right. Dude, this is look at this. Hey, look the at bumper's axles. slick. Look at the axles. Are those RCVs? Yes, they are. Damn. Dude, they have RCVs? How come we didn't know about this? Because you're not Lauren Healy. Yeah, you're right. Dude, this winch is bolt-on. Hey, man. Sometimes the truth is real. <laughs> this winch is all bolt-on. It's yeah. all modular. This one's dope, dude. You think you're trading his? I think so. Same sliders, similar suspension. You guys are good. 
Yeah. <laughs> I'll take it. Yeah, I think that's the set. The mount's oh, dope. Their tire mount is sick. Dude, bro. look at that, bro. I lift. This whole setup is sick. Yeah. Damn, I gotta step on my fab game. Look at that. Hey, dude. Who, get out of here, bro. Go to work. <laughs> <laughs> no, what am I doing here? I know where they go, right, bro. The steps? Are they frame mounted? No, they're body, but they wrapped up the whole body in them. Oh, okay. It's the first one that uses actually the top one. So. Yeah? yeah? I like this wrap. I always like the topographic look. It's just sick. I like that they did their own logos here. You like this like, truck that's, here? That's a nice touch, yeah. It's a good wrap. The actual usage of the truck yeah. is nice. Now, natural. The grill is sexy, dude. The fangs. Yeah. Damn, that's dope. What is it? It's a Badlands too. Oh, yeah? It's got RTR seats though. Okay. Uh, so are you taking one of these or are you taking the freewheeling one? Bro, he's got the same tires as me. We're basically teammates. Hey man, I'm basically teammates with him, dog. We have the same tires. That's practically your truck, dog. That's oh, wait, this is a four door. better. <laughs> hey, you notice all the pros have a four door? You see a pattern here? Hey, dude. What are you talking about? That's are a four serious? door. That's a four door with nah, a two door dude, shell. That's a dog. two Come door, on. bro. Come on. That's a two door. Fast pro. I don't know that, guys. Right here, right in front of the Ford booth. And uh, yeah, they have the Bronco Experience. Yeah, the Bronco Experience. It's so part of the. They basically set up so you can use all the bells and whistles on the pretty much all the Broncos have. That I'm sure they have fully loaded ones here, right? Nothing yeah. else. Yeah. So they, they'll let you climb it up, show you the descent, show you flex and disconnect back there. And then this is just probably just to see how the ride feels. And they make you do the, the two-point turn, or what is it called? Huh? Two-point turn? It's a U-turn. You just lock, you lock. Fancy U -turn. Yeah, it's a super fancy U-turn where it locks the rear tire. And uh, you basically just fucking turn. It's just, just that, so. I think it's called turn assist. Is it called turn assist? I think that's how you Whatever, bro. Something. We didn't sound very intelligent when we both own Broncos, but that's where they do it in the sound, so that's pretty dope. And uh, we're going to close it out. I'm just going to let these guys go back. All right, team. So that pretty much wraps up the episode here. And it's only right we do it in front of the Bronco setup here because all we did was talk about Broncos today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Yes, there was a little bit of a uh, dislike and whatnot. And, uh, but I mean, it's real. It's SEMA. We got to keep it honest. We also gave credit where credit is due. And uh, Oscar, you got any final words, dog? We're just having fun. We're not hating. Just yeah, don't, don't be mad. Okay, look, we both own Broncos. So we're talking shit because we both own them. Am I the happiest right now with my steps? No, but they're coming off. That's that's real. I love you, Weston, but you know, we're just being honest. I'm going to destroy those things if they don't come off. But if you don't follow Oscar, you guys already know his Instagram. And uh, day three is a wrap. We're going to go get some lunch or dinner. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to go out and party. See you guys later.